let me give you uh, what happens to marriage. Let me show you a verse of scripture you have never heard of that's applied to marriage. Turn left if you're in Song of Solomon. Look at the book of Proverbs. By the way, bring your Bibles to church. You, you, you can't know the, uh, the players unless you have a program. Uh, look, look at uh, Proverbs chapter 14. I'm going to give you a verse you've never seen used in marriage. Proverbs 14, 4. Where no oxen are, the manger is clean. But much revenue comes by the strength of the ox. Now, you don't have to be Phi Beta Kappa, exegete, or skillful in hermeneutics to understand what that verse is saying. Any Texan understands it. <laughs> if you have an ox in the manger, in the stable, in the corral, in the stall, you're going to have poo. Am I going too fast for some? <laughs> Paul called it dung. Now, but you've got to decide if you have an ox, says the book of Proverbs, and you're going to have poo, but, but you have an ox, you automatically have poo, but there is a profit there. Did you see it? There's a reward there. There's a result of having an ox because you can harvest, you can build things, you can grow things. See the difference there? So with the ox goes poo. But also with the ox, there is profit. And that's the way it is with marriage. Somebody said, you know, I didn't know we'd have this poo in our marriage. <laughs> you know, I thought that the birds would wake us up in the morning and the rabbits would clean house and the, and the, the, the chipmunks would, do, would cook breakfast and the squirrels would wash the dishes. I mean, my goodness. And I married in my marriage, we have some poo. <laughs> now that's part of it. And a lot of people, when poo comes and it just stacks up, and sometimes you have a sick ox, you've got more poo than you need. <laughs> and you don't know what to do with it. We, we give up. I married the wrong one. This is the way it's supposed to be. Let me tell you something. Marriage has joy and fulfillment and meaning in it. And there's going to be times that some things get rather sticky and stinky and unseemly. That's a part of it. And it's how we relate to this.